Hello, welcome to 21st Century Moses channel. My name is Sammy Ju. I have a question for you. Why are people rejecting or hesitating to come to Jesus? Do you want to know the answer? Then stay tuned. This week's theme is who we are. We are sinners. And today's verse is from John 3.19. Let's go to the first section, exposition. Let's read John 3.19. And this is the judgment. The light has come into the world, and the people love the darkness rather than the light, because their works were evil. Now, there's a definition of judgment, because it says, this is the judgment. What is it? It says, the light has come. Who is the light? The light is Jesus Christ. Jesus has come into the world, and people, this is the problem, loved the darkness rather than the light so they love the darkness rather than jesus christ why is that here's the reason because their works were evil that means if your works if you if if what you do is evil then automatically you will love darkness you will not love the light just like, uh, think about the roaches, right? Roaches do not like the light, right? They love to crawl under the dark kitchen. And uh, why? Because they are sneaking into the kitchen and they're trying to steal the food out of the kitchen, right? They, what they do is evil. So they do not come to the light. They always crawl under the darkness. It's the same thing. If people, well, the people are doing evil. So that's why they love darkness more than Jesus Christ, who is the light. It is interesting that the more you do evil, the more you love darkness. I heard a story of someone who used to be a Christian, but not now. This person continues to live in sin, conducting sexual immorality and other sinful acts. No one from her church did something wrong to the person, but this person stopped coming to the church, worship service, and any other Christian fellowships. The more she engaged with sins in her life, the further she went away from the light. This is what's going on all around the world. Lots of people sin every day, and they do not want to come to the light. How about you? The Bible is the Word of God, and it shows the light. It is the light. But when you read it, what do you feel? Do you feel that you want to read and meditate more and more? Or do you feel that you want to get away from the Bible as soon as possible and you feel the world is more fun and great than the Word of God? If the first is you, praise the Lord. Keep being in the light. But if you are the second case, turn away from your sinful life and come to Jesus. Even if you are in your sin, you can come to Jesus because Jesus first came for you. He died on the cross for your sins. No matter the great sin you committed in the past, God will forgive your sins if you come to Him. So do not hesitate. Do not back away from Him. Come to Jesus today. What makes you hesitate to come to Jesus today or in the past? Please leave your comments in the comment section below. Okay, remember the keywords here, judgment, light, darkness. So the main idea is light has come, but people love darkness. And this is the judgment. Now, John 3, 16 is the, the core of the gospel. Let's do this, okay? God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. So whoever, whosoever believes in him will not perish, but have everlasting life so that is the gospel that is really the light but just three verses down which is verse 19 we see the people even though the light is there people rebe rebel against it they do not come to the light they come they stay in the darkness and we see this many times but we still need to share the gospel so today's verses john 3 19 read this first three times out loud Pause the video. Okay, close your eyes and reset the verse word by word. Pause the video. Okay, now fill in the blanks and check it. And this is the, the, has come into the world and people love the, rather than the light because their works were evil. Uh, the answer is judgment, light, 
and darkness in today's verses. Yes, John 3, 19. All right, great job. Make sure to put your unique icon or emoji on the 365 Empowerment Checklist on the description section below. Tomorrow, we'll learn about how many people are sinners from Romans 3.10. So please click the like button, hit subscribe, and click on the notification bell so you won't miss it. Also, watch the Day 46 video of 70 Days Journey to the Bible. You can get the big picture of the Bible as you get the detailed picture of each verse through this video. Alright, that's it for today and looking forward to seeing you tomorrow.